Hello dear student. Today we are going to start exercise 14.3 which is division of algebraic expression. Division of algebraic expression. How we divide the algebraic expression. So here in this first question we have 21 a 28 x to the power 4 divided by 56. So we will divide the number by number and variable to variable. Okay. So here what we will see he, here 28 into x multiplied how many times four times x multiplied by x multiplied by x multiplied by x divided by 56 multiplied by x right i have written it in the format so that this is how just to understand here okay so this x and x will be cancel out and this 28 1 and 28 2 right so we, our answer will be x to the power 3 and divided by 2 this is what will get the answer okay we can directly simplify to it also right as we solve this question second one let's say 66 p square q square r q divided by 11 q r q square okay so 66 p square q square r cube divided by 11 q r square okay so 11 1 and 11 6 are and then p 6 p square Q here 2 minus 1 2 minus 1 and R cube minus 2 okay this is how we'll get to know so 6 P square Q and here 2 minus 1 so 2 minus 1 will be 1 and R 1 this is what the answer will be okay. here we have 10 Y multiplied by 6 Y plus 21 divided by 5 to Y plus 7 okay so this is as 10 Y 6 Y plus 21 and divided by 5 and then 2y plus 7 okay so anything is there in common in this two term right any common is there in that two term so that we can see here 10y multiplied by in this two 3 is common so that will get 2y plus 7 so 3 will be taken out and the remaining part is 2y plus 7 okay divided by 5 multiplied by 5 multiplied by 2y plus 7 okay now in multiplication factor you can directly cut out or say cancel out this 2y plus 7 and 2y plus 7 and then similarly 5 1 and 5 2 okay so this 2y plus or multiplied by 3 so 2 into 3 so that would be 6y will be the answer for it okay 6y will be the answer for it I hope you are getting it just simple question it is how to solve this one 6y just taken out 3 common out from this 6y plus 21 and then where from there we get 2y multiplied by 3 so this is 6y okay let understand here in the next question 26xy x plus y and y minus 4 13x and then y minus 4 it is very simple question as it is given y minus 4 and y minus 4 will be cancel out and then x x will be cancelled out and 13 1 and 13 2 are okay so remaining part will be 2y x plus 5 okay this will be the answer directly you can write from there okay simple it is x minus y a sorry y minus 4 y minus 4 will be cancelled out x and x will be cancelled out 13 1 and 13 2 so what is remaining part 2y x plus 5 this is how you solve this questions and regarding this you'll understand it okay to understand the next question we have y square plus 7y plus 10 divided by y plus 5 this is what the question is now this term we need to factorize thereafter we'll divide it so here y square 7y plus 10 divided by y plus 5 this is what the question is now if we divide this so here it is in the form of what a plus x square plus a plus b x plus a into b right so we need to find the two number whose sum is 7 and whose product is 10 so that is what the numbers are 5 and 2 right then sum will be 7 and the product would be 10 so this is what the number is that means the factor would be x plus 5 a y plus 5 and y plus 2 okay so let understand here we'll get y plus y square plus 2y plus 5y plus 10 okay so from here we'll get divided by 
y plus 5 okay now this 2 would be factorized at from here we'll get y plus 2 and then y plus 5 will be the two factors of this expression so here this y plus 5 now this y plus 5 5 and y plus 5 will be cancelled out and the remaining part y plus 2 will be answer this will be the answer so whenever you'll get the question like this so in that case what we'll do here you'll factorize the first expression and then after you'll divide that by whatever is there in denominator okay so let's understand the next question we have the question is 5p square minus 25p plus 20 and divided by p minus 1 so here the question is 5p square minus 25p plus 20 divided by p minus 1 this is what the question is okay so here let's suppose what is common in this all three terms we have 5 as a common so take it out 5 as a common and what is remaining p square minus 5p plus 4 it would be easy if you take common in this now now what we'll do here is just this factor is minus 5 we need to find the two number whose sum is minus 5 and the product is plus 4 so that is what minus 1 and minus 4 the product of these two number will be plus 4 and the sum of these two number will be minus 5 okay so let understand here 5 and multiplied by p square minus p okay and then minus 4 p minus 4 plus 4 sorry this will be minus 4 divided by p minus 1 so if we factorize this two times this expression what we'll get we'll get p minus 1 and p minus 4 this two term will get and in divided by minus p minus 1 okay now here this p minus 1 and p minus 1 will be cancel out so what is remaining the remaining part is 5 p minus 4 will be the answer for it this will be the answer for it so i hope you are getting 